for video streaming, gaming, social media, plus smart home devices and security systems. Standard high speed or cellular internet is just too slow, but broadband keeps your home connected. Call or visit Gearhart Broadband online. I'm here at the Floyd County School of Innovation where just last week the school held an open house to provide an opportunity for students to meet their new teachers. No one in the school history of Floyd County has ever had opportunities like this and nobody in Eastern Kentucky has ever had opportunities like this because this is the first of its kind. There has been a lot of wonderful comments as the kids have been exiting the building saying how they wish that they could start school now. Um, some of them saying that they wish that they could come here all day long, that they just don't want to do a half a day. I um, had some that said that they're excited. Some who have not liked school in the past have said now that they can't actually wait for school to start. Robinson says that this new innovative school coincides with the Floyd County School Superintendent's motto. And so his was to provide amazing opportunities for all kids and to be innovative. And I'd have to say that this absolutely meets that, that goal. Katie Moore, a senior entering the healthcare pathway at the Floyd County School of Innovation, believes that the school will provide a great opportunity in preparing students for college. And you know, that's kind of what you want to do. You know, you want to get as much college hours or whatever you can get in before you go to college. And I think this is also a good way to find out what you really want to do. So you don't have to go to college and change your major like a lot of people have. When I asked Katie how she felt when she had her first walkthrough of the finished school, I didn't have words, obviously. I, I didn't have words. Um, I just think it's amazing what they're doing here and all of the opportunities that people have. It, it's just blew my mind, honestly. It, it's a great opportunity and I'm blessed to be able to say that I got to go here for just one year. And for c kids to be able to say, I went here four years of high school. You know, you got four years of this. It's just, I, it's, I'm blessed to be able to be here one year. Although students are excited to get back to school and back to some sense of normalcy, Many parents are still on the fence about whether their child should attend in-person classes or just online. I'm just happy to see how uh, they have the desks spread so far apart and it looks all safe for the kids. And that was, a, as a parent, that was a concern of mine. But uh, it looks like my son is going to be very safe here. I think everybody's just kind of nervous, but personally I'm ready just to get back and kind of get back in the full swing of things. I miss going to school every day and seeing everybody and just kind of being out of the house. I'm ready for it. I'm ready for my last year of high school. <laughs> um, I would like to uh, thank our board members and um, our great staff at Floyd County Board of Education uh, for providing this opportunity for our kids. We want this program to grow. We want it to be more than just a half day. We want it to be an all day school. We want it to be uh, growing to where we have more than 100 kids that are able to come. We have some that's on a waiting list and hopefully in years to come, we'll be able to accommodate those students and there won't be a waiting list. That we, we want all kids that want to be able to come and do this to be able to come. Reporting from Martin, Kentucky, I'm Jeremy Justice with Mountaintop News.